Hey guys, Video Vixen here. I'm out in the street. Just coming from a job fair. I hate job fairs, by the way. Look at this guy. Ah, oh, Statue of Liberty. Salute you. Anyway, um, yeah, so I'm just coming from a job fair. And to be honest, I don't like job fairs because one, it's, I feel like it's a waste of time. Now, I've, I've been out of state where I've been unemployed for a while. And thank God that I have a job now. But, you know, at job fairs, it's kind of like the same setup. You have a stand or a table with a company. There's two people representing the company. They're telling you about the positions they have available. And all they do is say, hey, here's some papers. Here's our contact information. Email your resume. Just go on our website. And it's kind of like, you know, they just represent middlemen, you know, that, that you know, they don't really do anything. They're just giving you information. The same thing you could get if you go to the company's website. So I don't really see it as helping me. It's just like, I'm physically showing up to a place and kind of just BSing around with people that aren't really giving me a job. And this is why I don't really like job fairs. But, you know, I was referred to going there and I did it and it's done. So yeah, Man, that's over. Now I'm just enjoying the day. I'm outside, it's pretty nice. And um, I'm walking. I think I'm gonna walk to work today because I have a lot of time uh, to get there. And you know, why not? There's people out and about enjoying the day. And, you know, I was networking with people. I think that was another good thing about, you know, the fair that I networked with people. I met some people. I met this one girl that was trying to find a job. And I was like telling her, like, hey, this is not the place to be. You know, <laughs> I know I wasn't like shitting on her. I wasn't like saying, you know, you shouldn't be here to try to find a job because, you know, she should. And, you know, she was trying to get into, you know, a certain field. And but the fields there were like not anything related to me. They were like IT and finance and all that stuff. And it's like, ah, I'm not interested in any of these. They had the Department of Education, which I did kind of look into, because I figure, you know, why not? But other than that, it's just like, man, nothing really, you know, not really my cup of tea. So, I networked with a couple of people, I gave them my card, and said, hey, this is what I do, you know, check out my work, and who knows, that might lead to an opportunity. You never, never know. So, I'm kind of done with the job fair scene now, and, you know, for those who are unemployed, don't give up. Um, just find different ways of trying to stand out and being yourself and showing employers that you are, you know, separate from just a piece of paper, you know, because I think that's the only way that you're going to, you know, get a job. I think that's the only way that you're going to at least land that interview, I should say, because getting the job is one thing, landing an interview is another. So if you find ways to stand out and, you know, brand yourself, because branding is important too, if you find a way to step out and brand yourself, that you may be able to find or at least land an interview for a job that you really want. That's my advice, my job advice, to all of those out there who might be looking for work. And, you know, if you're in school, try to look for work as soon as possible, even before you graduate, and kind of just brand yourself into a marketable person that, you know, is going to help one's company. That's all the real advice I have. Um, but other than that, as I said, I'm going to enjoy this day, uh, day six. So I hope you guys have a great day, and I'll see you all tomorrow. All right? Stay classy. Fade out. <laughs>